So here's the SLCN checklist, the speech and language communication needs checklist. Um, it's a really easy tick sheet for you to use um, for some of those children in your class or in your school who are just low achievers or there's just something not quite, can't quite put your finger on what's going on with them or you've got a bit of an idea but you need to really pinpoint it to help you refer to speech and language. So it's um, set out into seven different sections that cover attention listening, comprehension, memory, expressive language and vocabulary, quite a lot in that area there. Uh, speech sounds, playing social skills and fluency. Um, and then also at the bottom I've included um, some next steps and things for you to do. So what you really have, what you really do, or you can give this to a teacher or a TA to do, um, for the child as well, is just tick. Um, for example, number one, has trouble paying attention, so you tick always, often or rarely. And you go through the tick sheet um, and it'll identify hopefully for you what they're always struggling with and whether you need to refer those children on to another service, speech and language, educational psychology, for example. Um, if they're doing something often, but not always, it's not always consistent, you might want to consider doing some um, interventions that can be either quality teaching interventions, using some of the strategies, um, that are suggested in my courses or some strategies that you might know of to support the teachers to support that child. Um, or they might need to do some TA-led interventions, um, whether one-to-one -one or in a small group. Um, so you can look further into that. But hopefully this will be a tool um, that you can use, and you can use it more than once um, for the child. For example, you can use it terminally to track progress, but it can be a tool that you can use um, to help identify areas of need for those children um, who are yeah, low attainers, low achievers, just something poor vocabulary, you just can't quite work out what's going on with them and then you can identify those areas of need and we can work out what to do. Um, once you've bought it once, you can just download it and then print it as many times and use it for 100 children if you need to. <laughs> um, I printed this one out um, into one page, so you've got four whole pages, or one that I did earlier on on a child last week in school, um, into, a four, into a single page check sheet. Check sheet. So there you go, hopefully um, bit of an example to show you um, my really simple easy to use SLCN checklist.